What, Mom? So, I just wanted to tell you that I'm going on a business trip. What? When? I'm leaving tomorrow. And it's in Paris. Can I come with? Sweetie, it's a business trip, not vacation. You're ridiculous, Mom. I'm going to my room. Wait! What? I just wanted to let you know I'm going to be hiring a babysitter for you for the first time. Are you kidding me? I don't need a babysitter. I'm old enough to take care of myself. I know her from a friend. She's really good. Is she, though? Yes, and she's super nice. She'll be here for like a day or two while I'm on the trip. Why can't I watch over myself? Brittany, enough. I'm hiring a babysitter. That's it. I leave tomorrow. Fine. You're ridiculous, and you're the worst mom ever. Just count your days. Count my days? Oh, jeez. I really need this vacation. Okay, I'm going to call the babysitter. Hello? Hi. Hi, this is Catherine. I'm calling for you to babysit my daughter. Oh, yes, I remember you. Yes, I'm leaving for my business trip tomorrow, so I need you to come babysit her. Her name is Brittany, by the way. All right, that's fine with me. Thank you so much. You don't know how badly I needed this vacation. I meant business trip. I promise you, Brittany is the sweetest little girl ever. She's not evil. She's totally sweet. Oh, she sounds adorable. Yep, she definitely is. Well, see you tomorrow. Yep, see ya. The next morning. Mom! Yes, sweetie? You're leaving now? Yes, the babysitter should be here any second now. My flight is really soon. Yeah, have fun in Paris without me. When you come back, let's hope all your stuff is still there. Brittany, that's enough. Stop with the attitude. And do not be an evil little girl to your babysitter, please. Just be nice. Okay, gosh. Okay, I think this is the house. I don't understand why you can't even take me. Oop, she's here. No. Sorry, wrong house. Bye. Wait, what? I'm sorry. She meant come on in. No. Okay. She is way too ugly to be my babysitter. I'm so sorry. She didn't get enough sleep last night. No, it's because... Okay, Brittany, enough. Ugh. Um, it's totally fine. I understand the tantrum. Tantrums? My mom better count her days and watch her back. Uh, am I interrupting something? No, 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 you're fine. I gotta go now. You can, um, just get to know her a little bit. There's a list on the fridge with everything you gotta know. Yeah, she's fine. Bye. So, I'm going to my room. Okay. Your mom seemed like she was in a rush. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, anyways. What are you still doing here? Uh, what do you mean? I'm babysitting you for a day. And get off my couch. I I'm sorry. Gosh, you stink. I do? What do you mean? I don't. I'm Scylla, by the way. And you're Brittany, right? Yeah. Listen, I get your mad that your mom- Make me food. Now. I was gonna say- I said make me food. So make me food. Okay, what would you like? I don't know. Make something. Jeez, guys. Chop, chop. I don't have all day. I think Brittany's a little bit mad. I'm not sure why. But I really hope that this goes well. I don't want to babysit an evil kid. I mean, her mom said she was a really nice child. Maybe she's just in a bad mood today. Everyone has their days. Okay, the stuff is cooking, but like I was going to say, is I get you're mad that your mom's on vacation without you. Vacation? It's a business trip. Wait, did she tell you it's vacation? No! She said business trip. Sorry, I got mixed up. Um, good, because she better have not left me here to go on vacation by herself. I bet she didn't. And guess what? We're going to have a lot of fun together. No. Oh, well, every kid of babysitter has a lot of fun with me, so I think we will. Uh, you're too ugly for me. Okay... Well, I like your shirt. It's cute. A little bit spoiled. That's so cute. And I don't like yours. Oh, okay. So what's your favorite thing to do? Just go cook my food. I'm starving. Right, right, right. Okay, we're off to a really bad start. Anyways, food's done. What's this? Um, I made some steak and some I'm fries. vegan. Oh, you didn't mention anything. And your mom said that you had no allergies or nothing. I don't care. I'm vegan. Since when? since now i don't want to eat this it's so unappetizing i am vegan now okay you know what it's totally fine i understand do you what do you want me to make you instead i don't want you to make me anything didn't you ask me to i'll make something myself you useless idiot okay why am i actually terrified of this child i just got here and i'm scared of her the mom told me on the phone that she's super nice she does not sound nice and first of all, she's acting kind of spoiled, to be honest. Let's hope this is just a phase, and let's hope that she'll get over it. Or else I'm gonna leave this house crying. So, what are you making now? None of your business. Alright, that's fine. <laughs> I can't believe a 10-year-old is a better cook than you. That's great. That's really great. You're independent. It's really great. Just shut up. So listen, I think we got off to a bad start here. 
What's your favorite thing to do? We can do it. No. Are you sure? Actually, you know what I really want to do? What? I want to go into my mom's room and tear the place up. That's my favorite hobby. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe let's not do that, okay? I could do whatever I want. No, 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 no. no. Stop, house, stop, stop, rules. stop, stop. Or I'm going to call your mom. Don't you dare. Listen, you can't just go into your mom's room and tear up her stuff. There's there's no reason for that, okay? There is a reason. She's going to Paris without me. I wanted to go to Paris to go shopping and brag to my friends, but she just left me. There's always another chance to go, okay? It's fine. And your mom's on a business trip for a day. That wouldn't be fun being there on a business trip. Come I on. don't care. Listen, do not touch her stuff before I call her. Oh, what are you going to do about it? I'm going to call your mom. She's not going to believe you. I'm her perfect little princess, and you're what? A babysitter that she just met? Well, exactly. Now stay silent. I'm closing the door, and you're going to stay out there. Oh, my gosh. Did a 10-year-old child just put me in my place and slam the door on me? Who does she think she is? I don't think this is a temper tantrum. This is an evil child right here. Hi! Ah! Why did you scream? Sorry, you scared me. You snuck up behind me. Are you calling me ugly? <laughs> what? No, 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 no. I'm not calling you ugly. No, of course not. You're calling me ugly. I'm going to my room. Oh, gosh. This is going to be such a long day. Brittany, I did not call you ugly. I promise. Just leave me alone. Brittany, please stop. Go away. Listen, I just got here. You have to get used to me. I'm your babysitter. I don't care. Listen, I get you don't trust other people, maybe, but we can be friends. It'll work out. Hop out. We go shopping or get our nails done or get our hair done. Blah, blah, blah. Why not? It'd be so fun to get our nails done together. Or maybe even go shopping. You can spend my money. Did you say spend your money? Yeah. Let's go. Oh, okay. Perfect. All right. Let's take this car. No, I want to take my car. You have a car? Yeah, duh. This pink one's for me. You? You're 10 years old. You have your own car? Let's go drive. Okay, okay. And don't ruin my car. No one else can crash it but me. Oh, okay. Okay, do you want to go shopping or to the nail salon first? I don't care. I just want to spend your money. Okay, then let's go shopping. All right, we're here. You ready to go shopping? Yeah, hold on. All right, I'll be in the store waiting for you. Loser. Brittany, this would look so cute on you. Brittany? Bye, sucker! Brittany! Brittany? <gasps> hey, loser! Where's the car? Oh my gosh! Brittany, wait! Brittany, stop! Wait! Oh my gosh! Woo! Brittany, you cannot be driving! You're way too young! I don't care! Oh, whoopsie! Brittany, please stop! Oh my gosh, do I hear someone talking to me? Don't care, I'm going home. I cannot believe that just happened. What am I gonna do now? Hey, you! Need a lift? Oh my gosh, you're back. Were you pulling what? a prank on me? Wait, what? <laughs> okay, I'm actually screwed. Looks like I'm walking home. One hour later. Guys, I walked all the way back to her house. Oh my gosh, look how she parked the car. Brittany! Oh, you're home. Where were you? Where do you think I was, Brittany? I'm tired of this. I just got here and you're already ruining my life. You left me there and drove up without me? You're 10 years old driving a car. Who do you think you are? Oh, sorry. Were you talking to me? What'd you say? Oh my gosh. Don't care. You know what? I walked all the way back here. I need a nap. Play on your iPad or your phone while I take a nap, okay? Okay, I guess. <laughs> it's so funny how she thinks she can take a nap in peace. Well, I have something up my sleeve. First, let's make her look prettier. Let's touch up that makeup, sis. So much better. Isn't she prettier? Time to chop off all that ugly hair. It's dead anyways. Whoops, almost got her in the head. Wow, she got a glow up. Now we wait until she wakes up. Oh my gosh, bro, I had the best nap ever. I slept like a baby. Good morning, Tilla. Oh gosh, jeez, Brittany, you scared me. Actually, you scared me with that jump scare of a face. Maybe you should take a look in the mirror. Brittany, I'm tired of you calling me ugly. I don't care what a 10-year-old thinks about me. Okay, well, I was just saying, the bathroom is straight to your left. Okay, bye. Why do you even have an axe? My mom got it for me for Christmas. Jeez, that child's a psycho. You know, I actually have to use the bathroom. La, 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 la. Ah! Oh my gosh! My hair? Wonder what happened to you. Brittany, you're dead. You're dead! What? Ah! If I were you, I would start running and counting your days, child. Ah! I cannot believe what she did to me. She ruined my hair. Don't.
don't mess with me. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna come out of this house alive. What did you do to my face? You ruined it. I could easily wash this off, but my hair? I cannot easily fix my hair. Actually, the makeup's permanent. Oh my gosh. If I were you, I'd hate my life even more. What am I gonna do? Actually, what am I gonna do? I'm not gonna survive. Hey, Scylla, can you play hide and seek with me? I'm the seeker. Go hide. Okay. You guys, I'm gonna hide right here in the laundry room. Ready or not, here I come. She really thought I was gonna look for her. No way. This seems kind of normal. Let's hope she doesn't come finding me with an axe, though. La la la. I'm just gonna sit here on my phone, pretend I'm looking for her. I just needed her out of my face. Oh my gosh, where can Scylla be? It's been three hours and she hasn't found me. I don't understand. Where is she? Later. Brittany? Brittany, game's over. You left me there for three hours. Oh, I did? I was trying to find you. Yeah, right. What were you even doing? I was looking for you. Anyways, your mom texted me. She should be home soon. Good. I'm home. Finally, mom, you're home. Finally, you're home. Oh, my gosh. Your daughter's a psycho. Why would you lie to me saying she's a kind kid? She was literally so evil. Look what she did to my hair and my makeup. And she just probably destroyed your room, too. I don't even know. Mom, it's not true. She's been lying. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just got home from my vacation. I meant business trip. What happened here? And babysitter girl, what happened to you? You look rough. Oh, Mom, she's been lying about everything. She didn't make me anything to eat. I was starving, and she made me stay up what? the whole house. You starved my daughter? No, of course I didn't. Miss, listen, let me tell you this. I made her food, and then she was all of a sudden vegan. So she made her own food. Then we went to go shopping. She took my, she took the car and drove without me and left me there. Then I had to walk all the way back to your house. I took a nap, and she did this to me. Look at my hair, miss. She's lying, mommy. I did nothing. This is permanent makeup. Well, that sounds like Brittany. Mom? You couldn't have warned me about your daughter? She's psycho. She needs help. Shut up now. What? Anyways, mommy, she crashed my car, so I need a new one. Okay, sweetie, don't worry. I'll get you a new one. And listen, I'm sorry about this. She does it all the time. It's normal. Okay, yeah, understandable. I should probably go now. Yeah, you should. Hold on, let me go get you some money and put my luggage away. Oh my goodness! What in the world happened to my room? Oh my gosh, the babysitter Scylla did that. I swear, I would never do that to you, Mommy. I did don't, not do don't. that. Don't you dare say anything. Listen, you know what? Just don't pay me. I just gotta go. Would you like to babysit her another time? No. No, 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 no. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. <sighs> She's gone, finally. So we hope you guys enjoyed this roleplay. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. And smash subscribe to see more videos just like these ones. I remember to always, always stick, stick together, together gaming. Peace.